Yo, 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 what up, man? I'm gonna get straight to it. UC704, all that. Y'all know. Um, what I want to talk about is excuses EA make, uh, and why I feel, and why I feel like they're excuses about this space and about we can't do it this gen and about fundamentals, 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 fundamentals. That is a discussion of the day. This is not a battle between 2K and NCAA, none of that. So don't get it, you know, it's not that. Because, I mean, this is talking about this game right here. No, this game wasn't perfect. But in my opinion, the best EA Sports video game that they they have made in recent memory. Besides Live 05, that was my favorite game. This right here is by far, you know, the most complete game they have made. Better than Live 10. And um, they killed themselves. They killed themselves. They tried to go for a physics-based game. And this game, you know, they couldn't afford a license, so they had to stop making it. Okay, all that. But this game captures, I mean, it holds the great fundamentals of the game. Fundamentals of basketball. I play basketball. I know basketball. I love basketball. Now, to a casual gamer, the, um, the, uh, <clears throat> you know, the, the smoothness, the eye candy isn't there. It's not 2K. That's what 2K grades the eye candy. But this grades fundamentals are bad. Look at this. this. is a zone defense. They got hands up. You see everybody hands going up? When you play a zone in college basketball or in general, your hands up. You see that? Respect it. The ball is tangible, and they got hustle. These are fundamentals. Fundamentals. This is live. This is live. I'm not even going to do... I'm not going to do any kind of separate breakdowns. This is live. I'm going to show you all this in the same video under under eight minutes. This game has a great fundamentals of the game. You got rebounding that was respected. Ball handling, court spacing, defense, uh, offense, running plays, double teams, charges. You had positioning, footwork. All of this was in, was in this game. I mean, I can show you. Post moves, all this was respected. Double teams were respected. Passing, the ball is tangible. They had a feature um, where you cannot, you can't you can't just run the, the paint with anybody. This game breaks that. You can't, watch this. Let me show you. This NCAA turn. I'm going to show you what I mean. Look at this. Look at the defense. Look at this. Look at this. I'm trying to force it. I'm trying to look at this. this happens when you try to force it. This game made you play real basketball. Now, was it perfect? No, but it made you play basketball. This game repli um, it replicates, you know what I mean? It takes fundamentals and put it in the game. You know, fundamentals are respected in this game. And I don't understand how that they can do this with a basketball game that was made in 2009. And they get NCAA 14 and Madden 14 and Madden 25. And they cannot replicate uh, fundamentals. And this game was a one-year cycle. I don't know if they've done it in two years, but this game was a one-year cycle. 2009 to 2010 was light years. 2010 was light years ahead of 2009. Hands up. Look at that. Light years. And I'm talking about a full package game where you're talking about uh, presentation, commentary, the authenticity, the essence of basketball, of college basketball was captured in this game. Look at it. Look at, look at, look at me swing the ball. Swinging it. I'm swinging it. No player is faster than a basketball. No player. Look at that. He's reaching out. I'm swinging the basketball. They're in the zone, none. You know, you can't dribble in the paint with a big man. Watch this. You can't dribble in the paint with a big man. You can't. Look at that. They rip it out. The ball is tangible. It's tangible. You post up. You don't protect the ball if you're playing against a user. Now, the CPU sometimes is wonky with it. You're playing against a user. You don't protect that ball. It's stolen. It's stolen. You can walk right up to you and steal it. This game had it to where defense, the ball, physics was respected. It was respected. You know, um, this game, man, like I'm telling you, this is, to me, in my opinion, the best EA Sports basketball game they, they, they created on this generation. And I don't know why they couldn't take this engine and keep running with it. So my thing is, uh, it's the excuses made by Tiburon. This is EA Canada, but nonetheless, it's in the same house, same publisher, but it's in the same house. So why can't our beloved Madden or your beloved NCAA catch these it catch this man the essence man why can't it catch this man bland like ncw 14 is bland this game is live i play this game and i feel like i'm at the game man i feel like i'm at the game when i play this game man you know this is the ncaa tournament i'm trying to win the whole thing with hawaii man but um you know i'm just talking about fundamentals this is no Shot at 2K or trying to compare this to 2K. I'm just talking about NCAA and Madden. Why their game does not, 
you know, respect fundamentals when you had a game in house that did in one cycle. So I don't understand what about the disc space and they can't do it. Look at that. Tangible. Look at that. Why they can't do it. And all of that, man. I don't understand that, man. Fighting for rebounds. Fighting for position. Pull it, man. Pull it. You know what I mean? So I don't understand that, man. You know, they had they 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 had a game that can do this. So why can't all their games be based off that, man? This game was to the core, man. They built this game from ground up. You know? Now they still had an engine where it was wonky. With the animations and all that. So I don't understand how that engine, that they kept the same engine, can be fixed to where, you know what I mean, they can tweak it to fundamentals, put it in the game. In football, they can't do it. But they want to add, they want to add um, physics and all that stuff. You know what I mean? And that's what eventually broke EA Basketball. It broke EA Basketball. Adding physics to the game, it broke NBA League. They went away from that formula. They had something they could have built on it, and they went away from it. You know, I mean, that's what I just want to talk about, man. They had a game that replicated... Uh, you know, fundamentals, and um, that got it right. This game got it right when it came to fundamental, fundamental basketball. Can't just get a, you can't just, you know, do what you want in this game, man. You know, the passing was tight, man. That's my time, man. That's my video. Elaborate on that, man. I just don't understand how EA can make these excuses about football when they had a basketball game. This game did have competition, by the way. They had competition the year before last, you know. 09 didn't have competition, and this one didn't. But they stepped, they they still raised the bar for this game, and with with no competition. So I don't understand why Tiburon came. It's just excuses, man. It's excuses because they know they're gonna sell millions. This game sales was lacking, and that's eventually what killed it. And you know they had to step it up because their sales was getting hurt. They had to step it up, man. So you know what they done? They went out and and made the game full out. Everything, presentation, everything, gameplay, everything, and it, and it couldn't sell, you know, because they had a bad rep. But at the end of the day, some customer, you know, always suffered. This game was more one of the most simulation um, based EA Sports games they ever made. But we got 2014 football that can't get their fundamentals in the game, man. I'm talking about fundamentals right here, not, you know, none of those, not style and all that, because this game wasn't perfect. But fundamentals is there. That's my time, man. I'm out. Peace.